breakfast today. I just woke up. Uh, I have school today. And I'm just going to do a little bit of my morning routine. Okay. I get up in bed. Okay. I really better sleeping, so I'll be quiet. Okay. I just, yeah, I do my schoolwork. I'm the first one in class today. Uh, I'm first one out of division and extra math. That was so fun. So here's all my Legos. And here is... 1700s pistol. I can only shoot one, but then. And then I'm gonna go down. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Got something. That's closed. Here. I'm making a video. Morning routine. And then I'm gonna ask for some carbonara. It's a Filipino dish that I love. Come on, I'm gonna make mock right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know. It's snowing outside today, and this is one thing I hate about, because every time you go outside, it can't slide, because oh, it's so powdery. Yeah. Right, let me just open this. So mommy has to yes. Oh, it's cold. Okay, I'm just going to close that. I'm just going to close that. Let's go inside. Yeah, that's cool. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, I forgot that we had to review this gun. No, it's bleh. Oh, wait. Yeah, I never said that. Here's the birthday gift that I got for my uncle and aunt. I'll do this in another time. And then I just sit down here and go watch some TV until uh, it's 9 o'clock. Because 9 10 is the start of my school. So, what do you guys want to watch? I just want to watch some Lego guns. Things like that. Okay. Alright, my mom says to go, to go upstairs. Wait, then did you? Okay. This morning, my dad usually has to be in there because he works home, but now he he can't. He has to go to office for the Buffalo Bills. He actually works for the Buffalo Bills. All right, let's get the remote. Okay. Ow! All right, tuck us in. very comfortable here while we just watch TV. Let's go watch some YouTube videos.
any of these? Hmm. Any of these? I do like war. Yeah, maybe I should just maybe I should just watch Charlie Chaplin. He's actually one of my favorite ones, but I just watch him on the phone. Not Charlie the Emilio. Charlie. Charlie. See, now they know. There we go. Okay. Check Chaplin. Great director. The tactor. I meant. Yeah, it's blurry again. There. I know you guys can see it that well. I'm just going to go a little bit closer. This is actually cool. By the way, I watched the whole movie. Not whole, but I'm almost to the end. Oh yeah, guys, every time I play video games, I play with my friend, Evan and Ray. Yeah. Alright, let me just skip this if you guys want it. Yeah. Charlie Chaplin is a Jewish barber in this movie. It's not actually a Jewish barber. Uh, the World War. 1918. This is the German... Wait. That's not how the Germans look in World War Two. They had a spike on their hat. Boo, that's fake. But they do have the right gun. I can tell. Maybe that's World War II. No, it said 1918. Yeah, it's World War II. Maybe I should just stop speaking.
sounds like James Bond. You can see that it can move. <laughs> hey, this is open on the track. Here, put this up together. Take this. Four. Hey, you, that's fun in here. Hey, you, come on, hurry up, sir. Just getting myself comfortable. I want the hat. Quick, 
it alone. You'll have to stay with me. All right, sir. Can you fly a plane? I can try. Mm. Oh, quick! Let my hand on the stick. I haven't the strength. Get ready for that gun, Sergeant. The enemy! They're coming! Quick! Let my hand on the throttle. Okay guys, that's just a part of it. I watched 12 minutes and 49 seconds. I mean, it's two hours, so I can't watch the whole thing right now. Maybe we'll just watch it another time. I'm just gonna watch something else. I'm getting bored.
Russian artillery and infantry counterattacks forced them back with a swift withdrawal. The second German attack was attempted in February to March 1915. The Germans were again optimistic with their new heavy 420 millimeter caliber Big Bertha cannons. The fortress was bombed with intensity, including from the air, which it was presumed by the German command would cause the quick surrender of its Russian defenders. The Russian command also had a similar notion and ordered that the fortress be held for just 48 hours after the evacuation. Remarkably, even with massive damage to the fortress and high Russian casualties, it would be held for months and the Russian artillery bombardment forced the German guns to again pull back. In early July 1915, the German troops were now under the command of Field Marshal von Hindenburg who began a new offensive. This time, they decided to use poison gas to achieve their objective as they knew the Russian defenders didn't have gas masks. 30 heavy artillery guns and 30 gas batteries were brought in range, and with the wind in their favor, the gas was launched at the fortress on August 6th. Along with the artillery bombardment, a dark green smog of chlorine and bromine moved towards the Russian positions. The grass turned black, and the tree leaves turned yellow. The Russian guns and shells made from copper were caked in a layer of green chlorine oxide. The Russian 9th, 10th, 11th, and 12th companies were all but annihilated in the gas coverage. Once the gas had cleared, 14 German battalions, numbering around 7,000 Landwehr troops, moved in to capture the burnt trenches. But as they approached the positions, a shocking sight took them by surprise, as the remaining soldiers of the Russian 8th and 13th companies, who had come into contact with the poison gas, counterattacked with all they had left. These troops attacked the Germans with their bayonets, showing signs of chemical faces, with their bodies wrapped up in rags, spitting out blood and pieces of their lungs. The sight was so terrifying to the approaching German troops that they went into a panic, retreating back to their own positions and trampling over each other while falling onto their own barbed wire. The Russian forces then returned rifle fire and killed many of the retreating Germans with artillery. Two weeks later, the remaining Russian survivors of the Osovich fortress evacuated. The newspapers would later call this the attack of the dead men. A huge thank you to Cash Quiz for sponsoring that was this simple quick. history episode. Cash uh, Quiz is a free app that okay. lets you get rewards and prizes. Hey, you guys had fun watching this video, and it took 23 minutes, and no, it took. 24 minutes and uh, 10 seconds, so bye.